We're heading to the Marine Corps League headquarters located in a former church near downtown Seymour, Connecticut. We've agreed to have a couple of urban explorers from Explorer LLTTF come to the church to explore it for ghosts. Uh, we've had a few members claim that the place is haunted and we thought it would be interesting to check that out. Okay, now we're uh, doing a little drone tour coming down through. This is the Trinity Church Cemetery. That's the Episcopal Church, which is actually up the hill from our headquarters, and that is still a, a long-running church. And we're just coming down here to back to Falls Hill, or what is what I guess called West Street. And here we come into the church, or the headquarters. All right, here uh, we're at the Marine Corps League in Seymour, Connecticut. A working functional pool table. The bar where everything happens. Right here, a lot of memorabilia from various wars that the Marines have been in. And over here we have just the hallway. Over here we have the main hall where events occur. That's what the hall is here. It's a nice hall. Of course, it's the original main part of the church, but it has not been a church for some time. As the, uh, the Marine Corps League, our headquarters here in Seymour. The bar. But it's like 116 years old building. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. There's always something out hanging You know, on. a lot of stuff's happened here that people, you know, probably never even mentioned or talked about. Mm. Who knows what kind of meetings were, you know, being held here back yeah, in the yeah. day. Yeah. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe they were, uh, maybe they had an exorcist. I'm saying. They, they got this one house called yeah. the Saint House in New York. The Saint House? Crazy, Saint. yeah. We went there. It was just the whole place. is just... <laughs> Painted with upside down crosses, Satan symbols. There's a big Satan thing on a thing. They leave you candles so you can light them. I was like, lighter. It's been very good lately. What is that called? Obvious Five. Yeah. The Obvious Five, being carried by Chad, is a specialized ITC device. ITC stands for Instrumental Transcommunication which means any phenomenon that attempts to communicate with ghosts or spirits by means of electromagnetic devices. The term was apparently first used in the 1970s, though the idea itself seems to date back to the 19th century. This Ovilus 5 instrument, for example, claims to convert environmental readings, that is, electromagnetic waves, coming from spirits into words. This model apparently also gives you the choice of English or Spanish. Ghost hunters use other types of ITC devices also, as we shall see tonight. By the way, I am not getting paid in, in any way by the companies that offer any of these products that I might mention tonight. My goal is simply to give you an idea of what these ghost hunters have and as their instruments of choice and what their purpose is. Uh, finds ghosts? Um, it has a word database yeah, in it, so when you ask questions yeah. to it, yeah. it, it gives you like relevant so responses oh, okay. based right. on whatever words. So if there is a spirit here, it can like pick and choose certain words to answer you so if you have a question. The way this thing works is you'll get a, like if I put it on them. Thermal imaging? Yeah. Well, it's like, it's got like 26 different band. sensors. Didn't you guys say Dude, you wanted to get a band going here? Around. You might have heard of see some of those nice orbs. Yeah. What's that called? There's an SLS camera. Farmer. SLS camera? Yep. SLS camera. SLS. Farmer? Yeah, the farmer had the jack in the morgue. Farmer. Got action. Oh, yeah. Bishop. Oh, I just seen a couple. Bishop. Yeah. I've seen a couple fly across. See, oh, there, there yeah. goes another one. The SLS camera used by the, Ex the Explorer LLTTF folks is called a structured light sensor camera. The camera uses an infrared light projector along with a monochrome CMOS sensor that shows things as dots arranged in a 3D formation. It shows live people 
as well as local spirits, as colorful stick figures similar to what is shown on the screen that you see here, which I actually produced here graphically just to give a general idea, you know, so it's not exactly identical to the actual SLS screen. Sorry about that. So I guess the camera shows orbs as well as stick figures that are supposed to represent actual spirits in the local environment that are moving around. All right. What is it? There you'll see black orbs just fly black across the camera. Black shooting around. Once uh -oh. we see that, we see you, you know, yeah. Through. We'll get some stuff out of it. We're going to get something. Huh? Let's see if we can douse some of these lights, that. too. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Going on I didn't do that. Phone. you got to be near it to, to, to have it set around. No. Say your name right now. Like the Ovilus 5 and the SLS camera that we've already seen, the REM pod is another ITC or instrumental transcommunication device. In this case, the acronym REM, REM, stands for radiating electromagnetic. The idea behind the REM pod is that it has an antenna that picks up electromagnetic activity by which a spirit or ghost would be able to set off the instrument blinking its lights and making sounds. We certainly had a lot of activity from the two REM pods that night. It's a direct order. Sound off. They like having a conversation. Did you die here? It seems like there's a girl and a guy, right? Yeah. He's, He's right in that chair where that guy died, though. Just a little. Yeah, they're just, they're just having a conversation. Yeah, that's what we're jumped down now. Oh, he's on the floor. Oh, what? Let me stop this. So we There's see. another one. We just had two of them. There's two of them. Oh, they, 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 they didn't like that. Oh, my God. Look at him. He's all over Jim the floor. Jim didn't do that? No. No, because <laughs> it wouldn't have stopped. You got him pissed off, Jim. I Sorry, I mean to step on my weed. Jacket. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he, he moved. He snaked and he, it. So you want it? He moved the jacket, and then the rim part started going off. There's the jacket over you there. No, no, no. Make it go off again, please, if you are upset that the jacket was moved. Oh my God! What? What'd you do, Jim? <laughs> you see it? Wow. Okay. Well, you can always hop over here. Yeah, that's that where the jacket where is that now. Was All right, so Tiz and Chad just asked him, if you're mad, set it off. It just oh, went there off. he is again. He's in another location. He's in front of the TV. He's in front of Chad. There goes a huge black orb. And another... What? Could you set off that REM pod again? What the freak? Thank you. That was nice of you. You like those pretty lights, don't you? There's Could other you... lights on there. Can you go to a different color? The question you can. Just wait 10 seconds after each question. That allows it uh, time to respond okay. to each question. Three times that night, we all gathered around a digital voice recorder to ask one question each of any spirits that may be in the room. The idea is to record the questions and answers because when you play them back, a spirit may be heard saying or doing something on the recorder that may not have been heard during the recording session itself. Uh, maybe we'll ask like one question each or something or yeah, whatever. Yeah, and then we'll listen to it. Okay. All right, guys, so myself, Explorer LLTTF, we're sitting at the bar area right next to where these REM pods were just going off and we're going to try and do a digital recorder session to see if we could hear any voices. We got Hermicidal J in the oh, back. What's up? There he is. There he is. There's Bob, Uncle Bob. Uncle Bob in the house. We got Jim. Right. Where'd Jim go? <laughs> Jim is roaming somewhere. <laughs> He's not possessed, is he? No. <laughs> He's He's looking, looking for a ghost over there. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get this digital recorder session started. We're each going to ask a question, and we're going to see if we can hear any voices oh, on the comes. digital recorder. So I'm actually going to shut my light off. Oh, uh, I think the most haunted place is going to be that furnace room. Yeah, we'll yeah. check it out. We'll go there next. All right. Hey, Bob, did you ever All see right. this sign? Yeah. 
He wasn't in here when we explained it. We Marines are only here to drink. If you need help, call the Navy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So what we're gonna do is some EVPs, Jim. Okay. So we're gonna do some EVPs. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do a voice recorder. We're all gonna gather, we could each ask a question. When somebody asks a question, just wait 10 seconds and we're gonna try to be as quiet as possible and no movement. All right guys, so we're gonna start up a little digi session here. I have one here. Explorer LLTTF has also brought one. Here we go. Let me just turn the volume up. Here we go. I'll shut my light off. All right, everybody. Okay, so Close. here's the digi right here in the dark right here with the red light. Go around in a circle, you start. Go to Bob, then me, Herm, and then Jim. What is your name and are you the one that was setting off the REM pod a minute ago? First we can. But before, like, I thought I heard something. I thought I heard, like, a whisper. Did your stomach growl? No. Not that I know of. Because I heard we'll something. We'll have to replay like, that, because I think yeah, I know what you're well, talking I need, about. I need headphones. I think I know what you're talking about. Because I heard something when we were doing it. It was faint, too. You yeah, tell. it was very faint. I, that's why I looked over. I thought maybe your stomach growled or... No. Nope. It sounded like somebody going... Yeah. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh. Oh, it's got something. You following us in here? Can you walk through the grid pen so I can see your shadow? Are you in there? Set off the run pod. Wait, there he is again. Look at it. He just walked through the bird pen. He's standing in there. Talk to us. I'm impatient. Come out now. <laughs> <laughs> Could you say a number of how many spirits are here? Four. 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 It says four. <laughs> I don't want to swear. The young Marines? Well, this was this was the church. This is the church here. Oh, this is the actual this is the, the actual church. So yeah. we have Can parties and stop, events. Please? Look at this, guys. They're like, no, they're not. We're getting some activity. Or not. It's not even the blue that's telling you that it's getting colder. It's just actual. It's really cold in here, yeah. Yeah, and it's not changing that light on. Oh, yeah, already. There you go. Right there. Right Good behind your you. uncle. Oh, really? In the yeah. chair. Oh, yeah. yeah. There he is. Yep. It's starting that already. Table right there. Right there. Was that you next to the REM pod? Turn on the phasma box. Is he following me? Yeah. No. Nope. Yeah, they don't, I don't think they'll follow you, but the, they take off. Mm. You get the next one. How about that other REM pod oh, over there? Can you make second. that one go Give off too? Pull it back up. Hopefully I get the Phasma box going. We have two REM pods going here. Yes. One went off. Yeah. That's why you do them, you do them in different areas. Yep. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mama. Mama. Yeah, I heard that. Look. Mama. Do you miss your mommy? Mama. Emma. Emma? Again? 
Is that what it said? Yeah, um, Emma's still here. Emma followed us upstairs. Thank you, Emma. Was that you, Emma, playing with the run pod? Could you do it again? What did it say? It said. It said, "Mama." Hold on a sec, girl. Let me make sure you're still recording audio. You miss your mama? Just talk loud. Just talk loud. So I got the audio to go with the video. Well, somebody's here. Jess. Jess. What's your name? Is it you, Emma? Jess. Jess? Harry, Harry. Harry, remember before yeah. we couldn't figure it out? On the Phasma Harry, box? Jess, yeah. Remember we were saying earlier, earlier we were saying uh it said like Harry or Larry or something. Right, right. On the, that was when we were on yeah, the it just Phasma said Harry box. on there. And now it says Harry. The name Hi, Harry. Sorry. Let's see if I can get there it is, Harry, right there. Harry! Can you play with that REM pod again? Cards. Can you make the green light go off? Come on. Just get close to it, just a little bit. You guys like it in here because it's nice and cold? <laughs> Come on, Emma. Emma, are you friends with Harry? Are you guys friends? What would that say? Nope. Like it just stopped. The red pot went off once and then I don't just got stopped. anything. I'm mean, like scanning back and forth too. Emma, did Harry kill you? Emma, did you kill Harry? <laughs> Talk to us. Are you still here, Emma? One of the last things we did that night was to do a third digital recording session. We sat around a table upstairs a third time and each asked a question, hoping for a response from a spirit. As the session was happening, none of us heard any type of, of response. However, as you will hear in the next clip, when we listened to the recordings, there was a double tap as if it was on the table after Jim asked his question. What you are seeing and hearing here is my own GoPro picking up the taps as I was recording, the taps that we did not hear at the time, but which the digital recorders of the others also picked up. I have to admit that this was one phenomenon that I, a skeptic here, personally could not explain, and I still cannot rationally explain these taps to this day weird Emma did you go to school or church here okay this video was a little unusual for me but it was quite a trip right if you like my little excursions into the often weird world of samsara please hit that like button subscribe and tap on the notification button also and again many thanks to explorer lltf and chisa chad for bringing their urban exploring expertise to our old church one winter night you'll find their links down below cheers <laughs>